Prosecutors filed three new cases for dealing in controlled substance resulting in death. The Marion County Prosecutor's Office attributes a recent increase of similar prosecutions to collaboration with local and federal law enforcement. Since the law's inception in 2018, the agencies worked to identify potential cases, then improve investigative tactics, and present criminal cases that result in convictions or justice for victims. According to the Prosecutor's Office, since January of last year, 11 cases have been filed. One of the things that we can do is hopefully help deter people from selling drugs, laced, cut, or just outright selling fentanyl. And that's part of our message here today as well, is not only do we think that we can help stem the tide or slow down the supply of these types of drugs, but it's also important to us that we're in a position to deter people from selling drugs that contain fentanyl. The Marion County Prosecutor's Office's first conviction was in 2021 and has since secured two additional convictions.